Today we are in beautiful Budapest, Hungary. It's super warm outside, so it's perfect conditions for a taproom safari. They didn't have an imperial stud here, and in Eastern Europe during summer it's very hard to find imperial studs. Instead, we have an IPA, a blueberry ale, and a blood orange sour. High expectations! A lot of honey to the scent. I like that more and more. Bitter. Kind of dark in the color. There's a bit of smokiness to it. Really rich in its flavor. But there's not that much taste going on actually. I will rate this a 3.2. I'm going to say it's a 2.9. Oh, the blueberry ale. This is going to be interesting. Oh my god, this is a good one. It's like drinking blueberry lemonade. It's really, really good. But it's very weak. I, oh wow. But the taste is very well balanced. Not sweet though. Sweet. There is a little acid to it. I have to rate this one high. I will rate this very high. 4.2. 4.2. The blood orange sour has a funky scent. It's really citrusy. More lime than blood orange. And not much of a taste. I think this is a fairly good one. Oh, I had so high expectation on this one. It's really, really citrusy. Refreshing because there is a little citrus in it. That's a sink to it. Maybe I did wrong. Maybe I should take this first before the blueberry. I don't know. Uh, 3.3. I rate this as a 3. It's a big venue. It's a modern venue. It's a really good pub. It's really clean, neat. And they have 20 taps. That's like a bit of that personal touch though. I rate this a 3. Still, I would definitely come here again. I'm going to say it's a 3.2. The staff here is really friendly and helpful. I think the bartender was super helpful, really friendly, made his recommendations. I give him a 3.3. What more can you ask? It's a solid 3.8. color it's like amber not yellow at all fruity fresh honey scent wow you can taste the alcohol oh it's so good it's a strong red thing it's not a bad thing this morning I had iced tea if you put hops in the iced tea you will have this IPA it's bitter but there's a little honey to it perfect on a summer day we be toffee in there as well I give this 3.4. I'm gonna say it's a 3.1. Smells good. Not much of a scent. That's like raspberries and lemonade. Summer days when you were a child. Oh, strawberry. This one is good. There's a lot of red berries in it. It's a sour without being sour. But also a little citrus. Rhubarb and strawberries. Still a little flat. I'm gonna say 3.2. I'll give it a 3. Mm. Oh. There's a bit of peatiness in it. Mm. The top is there. Lake Ridge. And even though the ABV is quite high, it doesn't taste the alcohol that much. Coffee. But this is good. And the peat, I'm not that into peated stats. To me, this is a 3.9. 
still, it's a good start. Our rate is 3.3. I'm kind of on the fence when it comes to the venue. It's a model place, it's really neat, it's super stylish, a bit sterile, but for some reason it works here. So I'm gonna say this is a free point for it. It's a modern place and I like that the brewery is in the room next to us. Still a little unpersonal, a cup of good beer, a three. I liked her, she was really helpful and she jumped on the opportunity to pick out the beers that we're trying. I'm gonna say it's uh, 3.9. Barton really knows her thing and she knows what she's deserving and I like that. I would give her a 3.9. like an IPA. It tastes like an IPA. It's not carbonated at all. So it has that flat IPA taste. Not much going on there. 2.8. Boom! It's as First taste is just sour. Actually, there's not much of a flavor in it. It tastes like a vitamin beverage. 2.2. You can taste it's a sour, but it has a very short finish. That's kind of good in a beer. It has both tropical fruits and citrus in it. It's a good one. I'm gonna say it's a 2.9. Oh, there's a lot of licorice in this scent. Mmm! There's a lot of licorice in the taste as well. A lot of coffee. A little thin though. I'm not sure it's an imperial stout. Still, it's good. It's a 3.2. Oh, smells good. And it tastes good. But I agree, it's not an imperial stout. It's thin. There's a lot of chocolate and coffee to it. Very good. But not many girls stars. It's a 2.9 as well. I like the venue. I like those small places. There's not that many people here right now, but I can imagine if it's crowded, it's a pretty good place to be. I will give it a 3.1. It's loud. If I were here 30 years ago with some friends, it might be the best place ever. Today, uh, I'm gonna say it's a 2.5 guy at the bar, he was really friendly, he was funny and he jumped to the assignment to pick our three beers. He didn't hesitate at all. I think he just picked his favorite and he did a good job. I would give him a 3.3. Super nice bartender. He was really funny and he was really cool. He was very helpful. I really liked him. I'm gonna give him a 4. interesting to explore some of the crafted beer places here in Budapest. Thank you so much for watching. Click subscribe, like and we'll see you next time. Bye bye.